Two years ago, 80% of New South Wales was under threat from coal and gas mining. Our state's farmland, water, forests and communities were at risk. So we rallied together. With our campaign partners at the Nature Conservation Council and Lock the Gate, we joined with communities across the state to protect our land, water and future. It's, it's essential that people realise the seriousness of this. We feed a lot of people from here regularly and reliably. Why would they want to gamble all that for the money they're going to get out of the gas? And the only thing that's killing this place is an expansion of a mine. Really, this just has to stop. I don't want to go to my grave not having had a crack. Really, the east coast of Australia should not be really touched for mining at all. You know, this is about more than money. This is about the things that are priceless. So clean air, clean water, and land to grow clean, healthy food. From the country to the city, we raised the alarm. We staged one of the biggest door knocks in Australian political history in the Premier's own electorate. We made sure tens of thousands of people headed to the cinema to see Frackman. We spread the word about Shenhua's plans to turn the koala capital of the world into a coal mine on the Liverpool Plains. When AGL came to Gloucester, we stood with residents to oppose plans to frack their farmland and we worked beside them until we won. More than 20 coal seam gas licences were cancelled across the state. Together, we stopped coal mine expansions in the Hunter Valley. Now, less than 10% of the state is covered by mining licences. There's still more to do, but two years on, our great state is in much better shape. And for that, we want to thank you.